up YouTube, it's your girl Nikki with another video for you guys today. Today I actually have another on foot review for you guys on a shoe that I opened up earlier this week with my baby Tony D2 Wild. If you haven't checked that video out, I would definitely suggest for you to click the little card right up above um, to check out the unboxing of the shoe. But today I wanted to just quickly review the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 in black and white for you guys. Um, I bought mine off of adidas.com. I paid 234 dollars um, so I paid retail for them which I got lucky I got my size 4 in these um, and you can see my uh, first reactions and everything in that unboxing video that I just mentioned so I definitely recommend for you guys to go check that out um, a lot of people enjoyed it and we're still trying to get 500 likes on that video in order for me if you guys want me and Tony to do a channel together so definitely still need more likes on that we haven't reached 500 yet so definitely go give us a thumbs up on that video um, but yeah, so I'm definitely excited about this uh, video for you guys because I've been wanting a pair of Yeezys for the longest now since the Oxfords came out and unfortunately I've been taking L's with everybody else but luckily on this drop I got lucky. I was like one of the first people to actually get a pair on the site so I'm definitely happy about this. Um, I know that on the unboxing video I like kind of tried them on. Um, these shoes. So let's just go ahead and take a look at these Yeezys. So this is made out of prime knit I believe throughout and then it's all black and then we have like this it says the shoe is black and white but it's really not white to me it's more like an off cream color um, and it's just going across the shoe on both sides. Um, when they started dropping the V2 um, style I didn't really like it honestly that orange and gray one that came out I just I thought that was like the ugliest colors in the world like I was not happy about those but then when they dropped the um the mo the other most recent ones the with the three colors which was green copper and red I believe the green and copper definitely caught my attention I was shooting for the copper but of course I was getting L's on those then when I found out that these were dropping I was like on it like crazy I was like oh let me go ahead and try and you know of course like with every Yeezy drop most people don't expect to get a pair but when I actually got one in cart I was just so happy and thankful and like I pressed paper how as soon as I could and I got them on hand so my box actually came a little busted so I'm not very happy about that but other than that let's just go ahead and look at this shoe so the bottom sole is kind of like a rubbery foam feeling and it's all black and it's kind of like it's kind of translucent a little bit I'm not gonna lie at the bottom and it has like these ribbed lines which as you know just every Yeezy has um, well with their you know their boost and stuff and even like their boots um, but yeah they're definitely a tight fit shoe I was worried because Tony told me that these were running a little bit small I guess so I wasn't sure if the four was gonna fit and they didn't have a four and a half um, but I usually wear a four wide in grade school so I wasn't too worried about it so I was pretty sure like they were gonna be fine um, but I know with a lot of these type of shoes sometimes they run small just because of how close knit they are to your foot and if you got a fat foot like yeah I'm sorry these might not be for you um, and I'm just gonna keep it real with you as far as like when I first tried them on they were definitely comfortable towards the bottom in the inside as you can see it says Adidas Yeezy and then at the bottom is all black and with some some white in there and the you can feel the foam actually and then it says boost um, and then on the side it just says supply 350 and of course these are backwards so one says it in like the correct way and the other side doesn't um i asked tony i was like i don't really like that why do they do it like that he was like that's just how they do it and i was just like, all right i guess i definitely am happy about this cop i'm super this is probably one of my top 10 in 2016 if not number one um but yeah, I'm super happy I got myself a pair of Yeezys. Like, this is real for me. Um, but yeah, I don't want to make this video too long. I just wanted to give you guys a closer look at the Yeezy Boost 350s V2 in black and white. Now, let's just go ahead and get into this on foot for you guys. Especially for the ladies, because I know not many females have a pair of Yeezys. So, let's go ahead and do it.
see my on foot review of the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 in black and white or core white. Um, I'm really happy with how these ended up looking on my feet. They definitely look super cute. I'm looking forward to use these more in my collection. And yeah, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe. Don't just watch a video and, and not subscribe to somebody. If you're fucking with my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Thanks again, you guys. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace. Just did, no, I'm not listening, no, I'm in different.